In this recording, so basically work energy and power available to question five. In the description box, so to my links for other recordings. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Okay, question five. But the arrestor beds are used to help moving trucks to come to a stop when their brakes fail. Um, okay, ngoba ama trucks nanga be a driver at higher speeds. Yeah, well, aba na aba ni higher momentum, so guba guba much more difficult to get the engine is slow it down on its own. So ama arrest a bit, ba build it for his interest of an analysis. With the if ever ma brakes are fail, I'm slamming with truck. Then unga unga gena go go log and go arrest a bit so that um like he arrest a bit. In a friction, a high angle in the la le guti le. Whether we move ang 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 momentum a high a high gang gaganan. Oxala yo, there's enough friction to slow you down. Now, let's say that the truck of a thirty thousand kilogram, the driver of a thirty kilogram truck driving down a steep road, drives onto a onto an ascending arrestor bed inclined at twenty twenty eight degrees. To the horizontal is shown in the diagram below. Lago 5.1 again, but he stated the work energy theorem in words. So, work energy theorem, the work energy theorem, it's work net equal to the change in kinetic energy. So, now again, the total work done on an object is equal to the change in the object, in the object's kinetic energy. So, uh, okay, this is one of the principles or laws. I need to difficult to ugu akoso. Once the formula we has your work energy theorem, it's very easy. It becomes very easy. We we look at we define. So the next time we koso, try writing down the formula. This is those kumbuza. Five point two. Basipa state basipa statement but the truck with failed brakes passes point A at the beginning of the arrestor bed at a speed of 33 meters per second the average frictional force on the truck is 31000 newtons while the truck moves up the arrestor bed so now it tends a guy okay um move moves anish or passes point A at the beginning of a, of an arrest bed. Let's assume what the track it somewhere la. The speed of an thirty three or thirty three, and then good frictional force of thirty one newtons. English. But so what is ignore the rotational effects of the wheels. Five point two. Give a reason why the net work done on the track while moving on the arrest bed is negative. Why? Let's try drawing a free body diagram. This is FG, and then gubanani, gubane frictional force. There's no applied force in the direction of motion. The moment the truck aye to yenzani, ikivela ilukanch i arresta pedi to. So, as well as the component of i i gravity nayo, it's also acting down the parallel component it's also acting down so there's no applied force or any force in the direction of motion so it means that 5.2 the f net here to is opposite to the direction of a displacement or motion and it over now John of the free body diagram here to the free body diagram is combined with the one armor forces they are acting down oh yes oh yes now pega argument this is the reason as he provide you the work done is negative over f net is in the opposite direction of e displacement 5.3 use energy principles to calculate the minimum length of the arrestor bed needed to bring the truck to a stop so if we now delta x in this case Hmm, okay, is what thing I look at e what's this? If free body diagram. Not that what it's required la na party for the sake of painting ilogaj e picture around the problem le na minang so you draw a free body diagram so that nang explain how one would include 
this is the track this is the arrestor bit inclined at 28 it's 28 degrees yes and then nibana ni frictional force down the incline and then ni nani ni no fg which is acting downward hang it let's say nibana ni na components the perpendicular and the parallel component this is the perpendicular component equal to that and the parallel component the parallel component no f yibo abasnigeza ngathini it's these are the only two forces um doing work on the track while it's moving up the arrestor bed therefore is seven sa e work energy theory but you use energy principles you can use any principle of funa non consecutive forces um it's up to you but when i'm using your work energy theory so work net is equal to the change in kinetic energy so the work there is work done by the parallel component of your weight plus the work done by frictional force is equal to the change in kinetic energy then we substitute together um ufg parallel it's times delta x cos theta but to theta is about 180 degrees more it's opposite the direction of motion friction no fg they are both opposite to the direction of motion so the angle got theta it's 180 plus the frictional force times delta x cos theta now it's 180 degrees with theta the frictional force over its opposite direction equal to zero the final the final kinetic energy over equal to zero over the track must come to a stop also the purpose of the arrestor bed is to stop the track so the final velocity is zero it means the kinetic energy is going to be zero so minus half m v initial squared then we substitute together on the left hand side in fact i force frictional force 31 and then ufg parallel it's 30000 the mass so fg is equal to mass times gravitational acceleration so we mass with 30 gravitational acceleration over its fg parallel it's sine 28 now sine 28 times delta x cos 180 degrees equal to zero minus half 30,000 in bracket the initial velocity or 33 33 meters per second squared right okay okay so let's multiply this one God. this one let's multiply this one so it's 30,000 times 9,8 times the sine 28 times cos 180 this is equal to right it's equal to this one cos with delta x delta x and then so you know, 31,000, 31, 1, 2, 3, times cos 180. This is equal to negative 31,000. Negative 31,000. Here we go. And then on the right hand side, it's 0 minus half in bracket, it's 30,000, close bracket, 33 squared equal to 16 million three hundred three hundred and thirty five thousand joules so yes equal to that equal to that now let's say on the on the left hand side in etalama in etalama like terms now so it's minus one three eight zero two four comma six four minus thirty one one two three equal to my answer so this is the answer 
and then elena ngehla jongo ngehla nayo jongo binjalo then then delta x is equal to this value divided by this value let's to ask the answer let's to the final answer it's what it's minus one six three three five one two three divided by negative one six nine zero two four comma six four equal to ninety six comma six four it's our final answer oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah so 5.3 this is the minimum length of the arista bed needed to bring the truck to a stop so this is where we end o 5.3 for the last question again for the last question for the last question, as born, last question here too, it's this one, 5.4. Lago 5.4, but uh, let's see. The diagram below shows the same truck entering a descending arrestor bed inclined at 28 degrees to the horizontal. Now, the arrestor bed is descending instead of ascending, right? The initial speed of the truck and the average frictional force of the truck are respectively. So, um, nothing changed. Nothing changed. Speed is just the same. Incline, yafana. Angle of inclination, yafana. The frictional force is the same as the previous truck. 5.4, which are stopped ascending or descending, will be able to stop the truck in a shorter distance. Um, I think this one is obvious. It's obvious common sense it in again what does common sense say it means the ascending okay imagine again when our parrot call a tracker who's over lula stop a tracker on a descending or ascending arrest a bit it's, it's obvious it's obvious it's the ascending one it's the ascending bed explain the answer in terms of the forces acting on the track uh, okay, so now we're going to get this one. So now we're going to Okay, okay. Let's say, I think it again. I saw Bonilla on an arrest of bed. There was, there was what? There was, I'm going to show how my forces are egg tile on the track, on the previous one, on the ascending bed. They were, they were acting in the opposite direction of motion so that's why seven any negative work done on the on the ascending one on the ascending arrest a bit but on the descending arrest a bit won't come forces up again pants so therefore it means that there's positive network done over i'm a forces they are all acting in the direction of a displacement so more forces are contributing to the motion of in e track on the descending arrest a bit but go ascending sibanani sibanama negative um sibane negative work done in negative work done it simply means that all the forces are acting in the opposite direction meaning slowing down the track so tinalana singati go ascending ah okay you cause this thing go ascending there was this descending kuna this kuna this right? yeah so maybe maybe I in words instead of writing it this way um, so yeah question 5 or question 5.4 it's the ascending bed is over is a sneaker a shorter stopping distance so yeah question five pillalana guys i hope we enjoy it i hope we told some value out of this video today um now we are balaksasa next week um i don't know in two weeks time or whatever good luck good luck upalegashi in the description box so to all my links for my recordings for now as one on the next one of course look like of course look share of course look share of course look subscribe as well so for now spawn on the next video bye bye